And right now we have breaking news. The MTA board has approved a controversial project that will send the so-called subway to the sea tunneling underneath Beverly Hills High School. Good afternoon. This is the KTLA News at 1. I'm Leela Feinstein. And I'm Glenn Walker. Uh, Dave Meekin, uh, one of our reporters, is on this story. But we just want to tell you that this was obviously a big controversy. Police in Glendora are looking for a man accused of posing as a police officer. Two people who claim to have been confronted by the suspect are talking exclusively to KTLA's David Begno about their bizarre encounter. Southland beaches from Marina del Rey to San Pedro passed with flying colors in the latest report card released by the environmental group Heal the Bay. The report to get a nice report card on our beaches right before the holiday weekend. That would be nice, guys. Also coming up, a local freeway is named the worst in the nation. Mm, Elizabeth Espinosa has all said to have the worst congestion in the entire country. A portion of the 405 in Orange County is also among the worst. KTLA's Elizabeth Espinosa gives us the rundown. A good 90% of Americans will face a lawsuit at some point in their lives. That is a surprising statistic, and maybe even more surprising, is more people than ever are representing themselves in court. KTLA's legal expert Manny Madrano joins us with more. Manny. Well, indeed, you may be. As always. Coming up, troubling news about a local housing market. David Lazarus explains why nearly... Wow, those colors, so intense. Yeah, you don't think of blue as being hot, but... Uh... That's what it's showing you there. There you go. All right, speaking of hot, we want to know how hot it's going to get. Yes. We have a big holiday weekend coming up. <laughs> Meteorologist Jim Castillo, what do you... All right, Jim, thank you, and more of your top stories are coming up next. Dave Beacom live in downtown L.A. with more on the big decision by the MTA. Yep, a big yes vote when it comes to the subway to L.A.'s west side. Plans for the subway to the sea have met furious opposition for months now. Yeah, but the MTA is choosing to move ahead with the project anyway. KTLA 5's day you distress swimmers 12 times as fast as human lifeguards. That probably doesn't look as good as in a bathing suit, but uh, Olgo Spina is live in Mountain. This news, you can check out latimes.com slash business. All right, well, two nonprofit organizations are working together to restore neighborhoods devastated by foreclosures. Uh, Gail Anderson is taking a look at one of this year's Build-A-Fun projects. All righty, coming up, a warning about calcium supplements. New health risks that may come with those health... Taking a calcium supplement is good for your bones, but it may be bad for your heart. One of us is. Okay, one of listen us up. Is. Now, Glenn... Now he's just showing up. Are you... <laughs> Are you looking to maintain a fresh look when it comes to your hair, Glenn? That's what we all want to do. You mean know. I'm not? You always do oh, maintain okay. a fresh look, that's for sure. Uh, all right. Okay, well, our Allie McKay uh, getting some tips from a colorist to the stars. See there? We've got your new summer look, purple highlights. Purple highlights. Yeah. Man. You know, blue hair. I thought you had to be uh, 75 and female <laughs> to have blue hair. Oh, well, what do I know? No, you could get your own, Glenn. Great. <laughs> All right, still to come, a strange sight in the skies over Detroit. Why hundreds of hot dogs? The Smithsonian National Zoo in Washington is introducing two baby cheetahs to the public for the very first time.